Hello there, YouTube. I've got the University of U20 Web SDR tuned to WLO out of Mobile, Alabama. It's an RTTY signal aimed at marine traffic on the high seas. And uh, I'm using the FL Digi decoder to decode the signal. And what we're getting right now, what we're hearing, is an RTTY signal that's sending out a marine forecast. Um, it's giving out uh, the wave heights and wind conditions and for uh, various areas um, I think if you listen to it long enough it probably would spread around and give us um, a wide variety of areas so anyway right down here if you can see down at the very bottom where the waterfall is there's the double RTTY signal and I've got the op mode on FL Digi set to RTTY 45 which uh, fits the signal perfectly and uh, have FL, I mean, excuse me, have the uh, U20 WebSDR tuned to 8472.91 kilohertz, which you can kind of play with that left or right a little bit, a few kilohertz to make it come in a little bit better. Uh, it doesn't, it, 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 it kind of sends, seems to float around just a little bit. Anyway, I think this is a really interesting signal. I read an article earlier today on Shortwave Listening Blog that talked about how WLO also broadcasts um, notice to mariners concerning pirates activity uh, in various places around the world and which I thought was extremely interesting so you can also come on here and tune in to WLO and uh, you know t fire up your uh, RTTY decoder and see if you can't catch a notice to mariners about any pirate activity that's going on anyway uh, I think this is one of the uh, cooler uh, uses of shortwave utilities that you can find out there and I recommend anybody interested in this sort of thing to give it a try. Thanks for watching.